Yo, what it do, man? It's my fucking RBJCT. You know what I'm saying? One half of the hostile figures. It's four in the morning right now and shit, and I can't go to bed, so I'm gonna do a fucking blog. You know, let people know what's going on with me, you know, my team, you know, my movement and whatever the fuck else, you know what I'm saying? So, first off, I'm going to start like this. Me and Mad Max are back in the studio together, working on uh, the mixtape and shit. You know what I'm saying? We are working on the album as well, but very slowly, you know what I'm saying? I ain't on a fucking rush tip or nothing like that. I ain't see, when we do a fucking album, we do that shit in a real fucking studio and make that shit shine. You know, we buy all our beats. We don't be jacking our shit. None of that fucking shit, dude. None of that. You know what I'm saying? Because the people that we fuck with are all official. You know, they're not no stupid ass, you know, you know, like, you know, half over kind of people, you know, that want like fucking $5 for their beats or nothing. You know what I'm saying? We fuck with like, you know, we try to fuck with the best, you know? Opportunities there, why not take it, you know? So... Pretty much we're working slow on the album, you know what I'm saying? Trying to get our bread up, trying to do what we have to do to make it fucking crazy, you know what I'm saying? For y'all, because when Hostile Figures drops a CD, that best believe that shit will be on iTunes, and best believe that shit will be in fucking stores. Best believe that. But uh, either way, um, we got a mixtape in the works. We dropped a little tiny, you know, leak kind of single kind of thing for you motherfuckers out there. Um, hammer shit with me and, uh, Maroney and Mad Max, you know, came on crack, you know, it's dope, you know, thank you for everybody supporting it, I can tell that people are liking it, that's gonna be on, uh, the Hostile Figures mixtape, and it's probably gonna be on Burley too, cause it's such a good fucking remake of that track, so, um, so that's that for Hostile Figures news, you know, we definitely, uh, me and Max's chemistry has been very good, we've been working on a lot of sick ass music, a lot of different beat makers have been making beats for us, shout out to all the producers that throw us beats like fucking every week, dude, I got a new beat, or fucking three, four new beats in my email, that's crack, you know. Pretty pumped about that, you know what I'm saying? I mean, it used to, back in the day, it used to be impossible to get people to fucking make beats for me. Now it's like, <laughs> there's too many of you, you know, and I gotta pick from the good ones and the bad ones, you know? So, even if you're making bad ones, good looks for sending anything, you know, we might eventually use it, you know, you never know. Because, I mean, there's intros, outros, interludes, all that shit, so... Good looks, you know, me and Max are in the studio, like I said. Uh, Burly Life 2 is in the works, like I said, um, a couple weeks ago on Facebook, obviously. Um, I think we've already done, like, seven tracks for that shit. Some of them jack beats, some of them custom, but a lot of these beats on this Burly Life 2 shit is custom beats, because, like I said, I like to buy my beats. I hate motherfuckers that jack their beats and then fucking make a song out of it and think that, you know, it's gonna fucking... How we, how do you expect to make any leverage off that, man? You're jacking your beat right then and there. The producer ain't gonna back you. So buy your beats, people, please. You know what I'm saying? I'm so suck fucking sick and tired of hearing a rapper go on stage, hear the fucking song, hear the song, it's the same beat or whatever as the next rapper coming on. It's fucking ridiculous, you know? <laughs> I mean, it really is. The only people that I fuck with that really anybody else can get access to is my man Verbal out of Canada, my man Anno Domity. I mean, pick, you know what I'm saying? Because they're all on SoundClick, but I mean, other than that, I mean, the people I fuck with, you personally gotta know them because they're so much fucking doper than all these other fucking whack-ass producers coming out making fucking sloppy-ass beats, you know? This is the East Coast, we tell it how it is out there, you know? Fuck your face. <laughs> fuck my face, too, motherfucker. Fuck everybody's face, you know? That's how it is out there. 617, you already know. Um, I don't really got many shows coming out, you know, right now until the fall because right now we're focusing on doing interviews for the radio and right now our single Go to Sleep with Slain is on iTunes and it is number six right now in the country, you know, nationwide. So uh, go check out rap, uh, rapattacklives.com to check that out in top 40, you know, for the motherfuckers that aren't believing and shit, you know what I'm saying? We number six, though, you know what I'm saying? Fucking real talk, Boston, you know, all day. Like I said, you know, fuck your face. Burly rap, motherfucker. Punch you in the head music. You know what I'm saying? Burly 2 is going to punch you even harder than Burly 1 did. Because Burly 1 was straight up clever. If you didn't think Burly 1 was dope or you, whatever, you know what I'm saying, fuck your face. Because honestly, Burly 1 was fucking nasty. I mean, everyone that listens to it and has a copy of it, it fucking says the same thing. So, 
Definitely all my Burley fans out there, you know, the Burley movement is becoming real. We got merch coming out for it that's going to say Burley. Like how this shit says Boston right there, you know what I'm saying? It's going to say Burley, you know, so it's going to be pretty fresh. You know what I'm saying? I'm fucking still drinking it. Like I said, we don't got no shows coming up really right now. You know what I'm saying? Until the fall, there will be some fucking ill shows coming up with Leeds and coming up with a couple other promoters out there. But for right now, I'm enjoying my single. You know, I'm enjoying embracing it. Shout out to Hip Hop DX and uh, DJ Bull.net for premiering the single when it came out. And uh, also Two Dope Boys. That was crazy. Shout out to y'all, man. I never thought I'd make Two Dope Boys, man. That's a that's an honor, yo. Like, salute to y'all, man, for real. And salute to Hip Hop DX again. You know, the only one I got to make now is XXL Mag, you know, so keep showing me love, y'all, and fucking we'll get there, you know. You know, sky's the limit, like Biggie said, you know. But being from Boston, it makes it ten times harder, so you got to make sure you buy the singles, you promote the singles, you share the singles, you share the videos, you know. Speaking of videos, there's going to be new videos coming out, fucking, uh... I don't know if I should uh, let this out yet. I'm not going to let it out yet, but me and Max are releasing a new video, you know what I'm saying, to one of our older songs from the EP. Uh, it fucking figures. I hope you got that by now, because that's a fucking crack affiliated fucking CD. It's dope. You know, 10-track EP on Dat Pit Free. We gave that shit out for free. Generous, you know. Same with Burley One. It's on Dat Pit Free. Sponsored, so you don't got to log in or username or none of that. You just go right there, click the fucking download. You know, that's how you're going to do your stuff. You're going to make sure it's not a pain in the ass for people to listen and to download because then people won't fuck with you, man. Especially if you a right rapper like me, man. It took me fucking eight years to get where I'm at. You know, I'm 21. I've been doing this since I was 14, you know. It took a lot of touring and going all over the world and the country and all that bullshit, you know. A lot of fucking connects, a lot of different aggression. Shout out to my man XL, you know, my uncle from the creators, legendary creative family. You know what I'm saying? Holds me down, you know, put me in the booth, you know, got me with the legends. Shout out to Edo, you know, for the success for our single. And shout out to Slane, man, for fucking definitely holding it down like crazy on this go-to-sleep shit. That's why we number six right now, you motherfuckers. And uh, you guys are like number nothing because you aren't even on the fucking charts. So either way, we're out here, you know what I'm saying? Hostile figures, burly life, Boston, fucking, I'm living in Framingham now if you want to know where I'm at personally, you know. And uh, that's, that's what it is, motherfucker. We out here, you know, threes, you know, high John, you know what I'm saying? Fucking definitely family for life. And uh, that's what it is. So uh, catch us, man. Definitely go check out the fucking YouTube channel, like this YouTube channel that you're watching right now. Click it, Rejack HDR, and look up my shit, dog, because we doing it out here, you know? Look out for new Mad Max shit, too. We're going to drop a fucking... A solo song on my YouTube in a couple weeks that he wants to get out. It's fucking sick. It's all mixed dope. Um, and I'm just going to say, you know, <laughs> it's it goes, uh, I can ride my bike with no steering wheel, with no steering wheel, with no steering wheel. Some shit like that. He fucking killed it, though. It's like a gimmick in the beginning, and then he goes in and he fucking makes it his own song like Max always does. And then he rapes it and kills it, you know, because Max is one of the best rappers out here. New Jersey and Murder Mass compare, baby, you know what I'm saying? We out here, all right? 617, dog, all day, motherfucker. And fuck all the haters out there. You guys all fucking suck. You'll never get to where I'm at, dude. And that's what it is, dude. Suck a fucking dick. Huh, <laughs> Burley. <laughs>